it sure felt like a derby, Coach. I mean, what do you what do you do when a game gets physical like that? You know, I, it, you had two teams, you know, battling and and really understanding what was at stake. And um, you know, we're we're real disappointed that we didn't get the result tonight, but very proud at the way we battled. And you know, we we had a choice. You know, you either step up or you step back. And I thought we did a really good job of stepping up tonight. Kind of mentioned a little disappointed in the result, but yeah. still an improvement from the last two top ten matchups. What's what's a positive you can take away from this? Well, game? you know, I, and and as I told the group, the best lessons are losses, unfortunately. And if we just keep getting a little bit better and outwork yesterday, um, you know, a game like this can come together for us. But we still got to get better. Um, we didn't get the result, and that's what we wanted. But you know, with the with the team um, and the performance tonight, you know, I, I could see where they're really focused and. Uh, focus on you know eliminating those mental errors and, and making sure that uh, we get our job done. Coach, you, you got a lot of set pieces tonight. Nine corner kicks, a, a handful of free kicks. How do you get one of those to go? I mean, yeah, I mean it. You know, sometimes it takes um, you know a little bit of something extra, um, but you know it's it's also something we we got to focus on because those are tremendous opportunities. I mean, we we saw the net couple times and we just couldn't get it um, so repetitions always my uh, my go-to the 10,000 rule I believe in but uh, you know something we, we have to f bring back to training and, and focus on speaking of finding the net Alina found the net for the first time from outside the box I mean she practiced that in, uh, in practice <laughs> she did let her tell you who she practiced with if she did that in practice no you know Alina I, I thought Alina did a great job tonight uh, holding the ball for us and, you know, then obviously turning and that shot was just perfect. So, you know, she's she's a kid who's been battling, battled back from ACL and um, so proud of her. It's just an incredible finish. Coach, how do you feel? You guys are down one nothing at the half. You come out in the second half, you need, a, you need a goal, you need to tie the game up. How happy were you with your team's aggressiveness to yeah. tie the game up? Yeah, what was it, in the first five minutes we tied it? And, like yeah, um, you know, I mean, the, the good part is when you play Virginia and you play Stanford, we didn't have fear. You know, we, we felt that uh, we got, you know, 70% of that first half and we just didn't finish. And uh, I think the girls felt confident and understood that, uh, you know, they were in that game. So I was just proud of them that, you know, they understood how the tempo of that needed to happen. and. Um, didn't back down. There were a couple times where Penn State was looking like they were going to put the game away late in the second half. Did that? Uh, it, it's a couple times. Okay, just, okay. just a little bit. All right, okay. I'm just, just a checking. little bit. They were they were getting in there. All right, okay. I'll, I'll take it. And uh, you guys were able to battle back and get yeah. back on the offensive. Were you happy with that performance by your team? Yeah, I mean, again, what are they? Uh, eighth in the country, you know, and for us to weather their storm and um, to deal with, you know, some of the, the players and the, the ability they have. Um, I, I thought we did a, a great job. You know, I, I, I never felt that anybody quit. We had a no-quit uh, mentality, and, uh, you know, there was a real sense of urgency and iron will out there tonight. And, you know, unfortunately, we just couldn't finish all those chances. First time all season, you got six days, I believe, until your next game. Amen. How does that yeah. feel? It feels absolutely great, and uh, I know the, the players will be excited. Uh, that they're not going to see, you know, another top ten opponent Sunday. <laughs> how's how's Lauren uh, Lauren doing after her little? Yeah, her we're staff? gonna, you know, we're gonna have the doc look at her, and you know that would probably be the biggest disappointment of the night if uh, we don't have Lauren for the rest of the season. But we'll know more um, tomorrow.